I'm in limbo. I'm in pardo. I'm a man without a country. I'm an immigrant caught in the wheel of time, the web that unconsciously weaves. This is not my home. It's not a home filled with all positives of God, of Buddha, and of the Bodhisattvas. I am not free from pain and suffering. Here I rest, just spinning in the wheel of time, processing all the possible karmic accounts and karmic patterns so that I can perfectly accomplish all positives, the power of enlightenment to be able to bliss out of this vicious cycle of birth and rebirth into the wheel of bliss. Kala Chakra, I pray for the wheel of time to keep moving forward so that we and all sentient beings may arrive in the now where all negatives are compassionately and consciously awakened so as to move forward and upward. Here we continue in a time which feels it's revolving backwards, asking again the same questions regarding love, hate, greed, and lack, which I and so many others already learned and processed in the past. O oh, ceaseless history, please reveal all lessons learned and apply the positive wisdom over all time. Let us never forget the open heart of positive consciousness and compassion and bring it into the present and future. So how can we both love the immigrants who have strengthened our country, created diversity and richness, and brought intellect, but then abruptly hate them and kick them out, and go so far as to build a delusion an imaginary wall. How can we feel so entitled that our feeling of lack and need for greed leads us to expect a paycheck without the drive to succeed nor the humility it takes to reinvent oneself in the face of failure? And above all, how can we practice interconnectedness and compassion for all sentient beings while outputting solutions that help one and hinder the next? We are all immigrants. We all stepped on this land called Earth as foreigners at one point in time and devoted ourselves to spin the wheel forward in this land of the free. We overcame our prior judgments and fear of differences by acknowledging that we are all part of the great American melting pot. There is no need to go back in time where our physical skin color sent shooting fear through our system. We have lived together for hundreds of years and learned many lessons upon which we built this country. We are the people. In order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and support the blessing of liberty to ourselves and our posterity, do ordain and establish this constitution for the United States of America. We are in this universal cocoon to work independently as an individual, but then to interact with others and integrate. By assimilating, we can help to rid ourselves of the imprints and beliefs of the minds of attachment and aversion so that all negatives and all prior judgments can remain when we leave the cocoon and liberate into the universe of all positives. Kala Chakra, compassionate and conscious heart, please pump faster, awaken the sleeping and numbed hearts that arise due to envy and jealousy, love and hate, greed and lack, attachment and aversion. Awaken those that are blinded and deep in their own suffering so far as to violate important human rights. Spin the wheel to the present where we can attain an abundance of a spiritual awakening and knowledge while effortlessly working to relinquish all negatives. Compassionate and conscious heart, I pray, dispel all ignorance of the ego so that we do not blindly become lured by the emotions of others and become wrapped up in a web that unconsciously weaves. O blessed one, cleanse and purify, I pray, all the accumulations of sins, obscurations, faults, and negativities which I and all beings have collected throughout beginningless times. 